Hi, I'm Sarah Weger. My closest friends call me Weegs, and so that's why I named my company, my greeting card company, Hey Weegs, because it's my personal favorite greeting. It means I get to see them. And okay, can you hold on one second until I'm done? Yeah. I tried recording this like 17 times, and the deadline is coming right up, so I'm just gonna keep going. Sorry. Uh, obviously, I'm a mom. <laughs> I've got the most awesome four-year-old in the world. Um, she's right next to me, and. I started my company because I started about two and a half years ago and I say that I started it accidentally because I used to create greeting cards every time as a, I was a graphic designer for about 10 years and I would get invited to like my friend's baby showers and, and it was my parents anniversary. I had some, can you hold on just a second until I'm almost done, okay? I'm sorry. I'll figure out how to edit this. I'm sure. Um, so I would, I'd go to the store to try to find a card that sounded like me and it didn't. <laughs> like I wanted to get a wedding card for my friends that said something I would have wanted to hear after my wedding and I couldn't do that. So I made this one because honestly, that's what I wanted to hear. Um, <laughs> anyway, and I, so I was making cards accidentally and then after becoming a mom, I was also diagnosed with postpartum depression and anxiety and it was, obviously a really hard time in my life. And as part of my healing, I, I got to creating again, except for doing design work. It was making cards that I had wanted to receive because I realized we're really bad at saying the right things to people when they're struggling. And even if we do try to reach out and say something, we often out of good intentions, of course, like say that we just say the wrong thing. And it's just, I suddenly had this obligation to create cards for people that were maybe like me going through a really hard thing, moms especially, that just wanted to feel seen and heard. And so actually the first card I ever designed when I thought, oh, maybe I should do cards, like maybe I should do these types of cards is this one. And it says, uh, what doesn't kill you makes you want to drop kick everyone who says it makes you stronger. And then the other one was like, congrats on your baby. Sorry about your boobs. Uh, I did another one that said, congrats on your baby, sorry about your hair. No one told me about the postpartum yeah. hair loss that happens. So just stuff, just funny things like that, but it's evolved and I now create cards that like, that just don't exist yet. Like a Mother's Day collection for people that d have lost their mom or they have a weird relationship or just, that's true. Um, but I, I'm applying and I'm here because I feel so, tired and frustrated by the fact that I feel like I've been spinning my wheels the last however two and a half years and I don't have a lot to show for it yet in terms of how much my business has grown and I'm super frustrated I know I have a lot of great ideas I know people love my cards I I haven't I need someone to guide me who's done this type of thing before so that I can keep working on what I know I'm good at and and that is reaching people through my cards and helping people feel seen. Like that's really what I want to do. And so I'm here applying. I would love, love, love a scholarship. Uh, thank you for your consideration. God, this is such a long video.